CBS The Young and the Restless spoilers. Next week's updates, April 17th to the 21st. Many introductory videos leaked photos that we see are the scene of Jeremy dead, lying in a pool of blood and motionless. Everything because more perfect when Phyllis' faces and hands were also covered in blood. Surely she's the killer. Jeremy and Phyllis had an extremely tense argument and no one was willing to give in to anyone. In the end, they were forced to resort to violence to settle. Jeremy just wanted to strangle Phyllis to scare her, but he didn't expect that Phyllis had prepared a large knife and stabbed Jeremy in the chest. His heart was badly wounded and died instantly. The case that shocked the whole town will soon be unraveled, and at the moment, no one knows what happened. Phyllis wants to destroy his body. After destroying it, Phyllis will leave the Genoa, the same way she went missing. No one knows where she is, and Jeremy will also be guessed that he was escaped from Genoa, missing. And no one cares about this couple anymore. If they don't come back, that was Phyllis's perfect plan. But at the very least, she couldn't properly dispose of that corpse by herself. Jeremy was big and heavy, so Phyllis clearly needed help. But would Phyllis call for more allies? She's afraid of involving others as well as being denounced by others, so she does this alone. Chance has a cop. He suspects that something bad's going on. But he has to have proof, right? He always tried to follow Jeremy, but was discovered by him and cut his tail. The only person who can come here is Diane. Phyllis and Diane will work together to dispose of this corpse as quickly as possible. Phyllis will quietly leave Genoa in a daze, but this is not a good plan. She should present herself to everyone and make it public that she is innocent and harmed. And the police will protect her. Mariah and Tessa brought home a baby and she introduced it as their baby. The process of transferring the name as well as recognizing Tariah as the baby's official guardian is also completed. Hopefully when the baby grows up, his biological mother won't come back and claim her baby back. Otherwise, everyone will be very bad. Mariah and Tessa need to work together to raise this baby. Tessa's spirit and health are currently extremely low. If she continued to put effort into this baby, she'd be exhausted. But in return, Tessa and Mariah's splits are, spirits are very comfortable. There are rumors that Sally's child will be adopted by Tariah, but it's very unlikely that this will happen. 